As an entrepreneur, you will be obliged to do quite a few speeches to your customers, your shareholders, your employees, etc. So speaking will be an integral part of your job. Aristotle actually defined three main principles of a good speech. I've added one here and I'm going to present these four principles of a good speech today. Hey, my name is Armin El Rao. I'm the founder of A. Leonard Rao, the entrepreneur's entrepreneur, and I'm helping entrepreneurs to become great leaders. This video today is about speaking. If you don't want to miss any of my contents, please click on the button below this video and subscribe to my channel, and you will always be on top of things. The first principle of a good speech is called, according to Atlas Total, is called ethos. And ethos stands for character. So in this um, sense, what um, you have to describe in uh, your speech is something like the greater good. Uh, something like, for example, our company stands for honesty, for ambition, and for integrity. So that would be uh, signs of ethos which are <clears throat> very important to mention in a speech. First point, ethos. The second Aristotelian principle is logos and logos is the Greek word for the word. What it actually means is you know the expression logical that your speech has got a certain structure. So for example you would have an introduction, a main part and an end and that would make it a structured speech or as Mark Twain would say tell them what you're going to tell them tell them and then tell them what you've told them pathos is principle number three of Aristotle and pathos means passion so you have to give your speech a certain energy make it something big um, <clears throat> show your passion for the things that you are doing and Include it in your speech. If you do something big, if you're really excited about it, show it, show the pathos that you have. So that are the three principles that Aristotle introduced. Mm, ethos, logos, and pathos. And let me just introduce another one, which in Latin you would call lepos. And what is lepos? Lepos is actually the Latin word for humor. And I really believe with a little pitch of humor, every speech becomes better. So crack the old joke, give a little anecdote, be a little bit ironic, maybe even self-ironic. And that makes it much, much lighthearted, much more lighthearted. And your uh, listeners, they will actually uh, like what you are hearing. So as a conclusion, you are an entrepreneur. You will have to do a lot of speeches to people who you want to listen you want them to listen to you and a good rule uh, to follow or good principles to follow are the three Aristotle principles like ethos, logos and pathos. And number four, lepos, that's the one that I added because I think a little bit of fun has to be in a good speech. Now, the live program is going to teach you all of this and many more of the tricks of successful entrepreneurial leaders within weeks. If you want to learn more about leadership, Leadership for Entrepreneurs, subscribe to the channel and give us a thumbs up, please, if you like the contents of that video. And don't forget, lead yourself.